Let's go see what's new at Dollar Tree and I already am peeping some fall. Hey you guys, fall hit Dollar Tree guys, and I found so many goodies so I'm so excited about today's video. As soon as I was parking I saw that they had the flowers outside and I was so excited to see all the new things they got. I feel like these flowers, they're just so vibrant. They can never go wrong with all of these colors. This cannot go wrong in your house either. If you choose any of these, I'm sure that it's going to look so nice and festive. They had a lot of different colors to choose from in that spectrum of fall area, of course. They also had these little pricks where you can put them into your yard if you have a yard. They have a ton of signs. Anything that you are trying to go for, I feel like the a Dollar Tree will accommodate. They had a ton of like ribbons if you are a DIYer. There's a lot of those also. They had these signs. They seemed a little bit bigger than normal, so I did like that. I forgot to get the pumpkin patch one, so I'm going to have to be going back. I did get a few of these LED lights. I feel like lights always make your house so warm and cozy. And for $1.25, that is a steal. I feel like I've been sleeping on Dollar Tree. But look at these signs. You could put these outside of your house or just in your in your in your apartment or home and make it look super cute for five dollars you guys i know i was salty when the prices went up at dollar tree at one point but this right here is worth it these are so expensive even at walmart they're expensive you really can't find none of these for five dollars and these little stands also so adorable i loved them the hocus pocus was our favorite me and my daughter watch Hocus Pocus every year, and that was my favorite. It's a little stand for $5, and these rugs, you guys, were such good quality. I did not get any. I'm more of a fall decorator. I don't decorate a ton of Halloween, and they didn't have any fall Matt, so I was a little sad about that, but the quality on those, if you do decorate for Halloween... Is so good. It sticks to the ground. You're not going to be tripping over those. I loved these little sparkly auburn leaves. I got a few of those. I don't know what my theme is going to be this year. So I'm kind of just getting a feel for it. But I am going to be doing a decorate with me for fall. Here coming up very soon. So be looking out for that. Those are my favorite videos to do. And I just cannot wait. They have tons of stands for your coffee bar or for your shelves just to lighten up the mood. I love these bows here. I feel like I wanted to do something with them. I just don't know what yet. The black and orange plaid was my favorite. They always have a ton of arts and crafts. So if you're making something, they have a lot there instead of going to Hobby Lobby. These were new pumpkins I hadn't seen. They are $3, so that may be why. The black and white is always popular pattern, so I have seen that one, but the others I have not. This iridescent skeleton was such a pretty color. I'm assuming others liked it since there was not a ton of those. And I love these lights. They were for $5. They lit up so nicely. I wanted the pumpkin ones, but I had already bought a few of the leaf uh, light so i didn't get any of these but if you do decorate halloween these would be such a good way to decorate this eye flower reminded me of the eye from hocus pocus such a cute little flower i didn't take none of these halloween decor though i did like these lights i was debating on getting the orange just for the fall season but i did not but those were such a good deal for five dollars again they had a few web lights also for $5. We're not used to paying $5 at Dollar Tree, but some of this stuff is worth it. Like this little lantern pumpkin that lights up. I just, I feel like anything that lights up is going to be worth it. Of course, you have to buy batteries and I always do try to stock up on batteries, but just keep that in mind. These are also new. They're four feet tall inflatables for the kids and they look super cute. And I had to get this candy corn garland. I already have done a candy corn theme before, so I just wanted to add on to that. 
these were just some plush throw blankets for five dollars these were very soft and if you're needing new ones this is definitely a place to go because they are so much more expensive anywhere else garland you can never go overboard with garland i have a ton of garland and it just warms up the house they had a few little bows and clips so if you are these are just perfect if you want to do your own wreath i feel like you can just add on so much of these things and make them pop these glitter bats were actually super sparkly in person the witch's in sign i loved that Dollar Tree was just really stocked up this day. I went on a Thursday. Now this paper lantern, I loved it so much. I wanted to get it, but again, I don't do a ton of Halloween. And they don't have a lot of fall stuff like that. Any lanterns and other lights also, they didn't have a ton of. So I was a little bit sad about that. But if you decorate for Halloween, definitely need to go to Dollar Tree. All right, you guys, I want to thank you so much if you stuck with me through to the end. And until next video, bye, you guys.